Hi friends, it's Francine from early on. And as you can see, it's snowing quite heavily outside today. But you know what we're going to do? Today, we're going to make some snow inside, just with a couple of ingredients that you might have around your house. So first thing we need is some baking soda. And I imagine if your mom or your dad or whoever cooks in your house or does some baking, you'll find some baking soda in one of your cupboards. So that's the first ingredient that we need. And the second ingredient that we need to make our snow is hair conditioner. And if you look in your bathroom, uh, you might find some hair conditioner. And what I have today is white. And this was from my shower, so we're going to use that today. So the only two ingredients you need to make snow is some baking soda and some white hair conditioner. So let's get started. So what I'm going to do first, I have my measuring cups and we need two and a half cups of the baking soda. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to fill up my number one cup, right to the top, make sure it's nice and level. I'm going to put one in my container. There's one cup, and I'm going to put another cup in. Ooh, and that one's empty. I'm going to use a little bit more of this one. A little shake so it's nice and level on the top. And we have two. And I need a half, a half a cup more. I'm going to use this little guy. I need two and a half cups of my white baking soda. Make sure it's level on the top. And there's my two and a half cups of baking soda. The next thing we need is our white hair conditioner. And you can use any kind of conditioner brand name, but it, it needs to be white. And I put this one in the fridge for about a half an hour and just cooled it up a bit. But I need half a cup of my white hair conditioner. Pretty thick. See it? Make sure it's nice and level. That's my half a cup of my hair conditioner. I'm going to put it in, scrape it in there a bit. Make sure you get it all. There we go. And the next thing we do, I'm just going to mix it together and mix it together. And just keep mixing and mixing until you kind of get a consistency and it's kind of packy, just like snow outside. Now, if you want to make more than this, you would just double the recipe. Now it smells quite nice. I know you can't smell it, but it actually has a nice little smell. And it's getting to look more and more like snow. You can see. Nice and packy. I'm just going to give it a couple more stirs. I'm going to put that down as I roll my sleeves up a bit. You can see. Now it's, oh, it's quite packy, as you can see. And it's quite cool. Now you don't have to put the, the conditioner in the fridge. I did, but you don't need to because for some reason, it feels cool like the snow even without putting it in the fridge. But as you can see, it's packy. You can see if you can make a snowball. Maybe you could make a snowman. What you could do if you have any other little animals or little toys around your house, you can play in the snow. You can get some shovels out and, and put it on your snow. Oh. It feels really nice and soft. Makes your hands nice and soft too. So this is a really great activity that you can try at home. Like I said, you can get little shovels 
you can get your cars and go through it, get little animals, like maybe some winter animals, like a polar bear or an arctic fox, and play in the snow. So I'm going to show you my recipe for fake snow. So remember, just you mix two and a half cups of your baking soda and half a cup of your conditioner, and away you go. You have your own snow that you can play in the house with. I'm glad to join me today, and I hope you try it to this activity out at home. Thanks for joining me.